So what this is, this is a milkweed. We saw this earlier in our film. And this beautiful plant has some beautiful characteristics. It actually has toxins that are growing throughout the plant. And um, these toxins then are transferred to the monarch butterfly, which doesn't get affected by the toxins. However, the butterfly uses them to its advantage to ward off predators and whatnot from eating the butterfly, the monarch. Um, the monarch will, will lay its eggs on the milkweed plant and then the, the, um, the larva will then chew away the leaves, eating the milkweed plant, gathering that resistance. So you might want to consider allowing these milkweed plants to grow in your garden because uh, what they do is, is they give a habitat, a, a natural native habitat to monarch butterflies and therefore, um, you know, there's more monarch butterflies in the world. And not only that, monarch butterflies have a very unique position in life. What they do is they will literally fly all the way down to South America in a specific um, part of South America and they'll, they'll migrate over there for the winter. And that one monarch will take, this is, this is a honeybee you're actually looking at right now. Um, so this not only, um, you know, gives life to monarchs, but it gives life to other insects as well. But as I was saying, the monarch will make its migration all the way south to, to South America. And it will live there, dormant. And then what it does is once it's spring again, it will fly as far as it can back to the United States, up northward, maybe to here. But as it's flying, it dies. But, but when it dies, it lays an egg and will lay that egg. And then that baby will then go further north. And then they might have three generations going further north. And then finally, once they get to the resting place, it, be, it turns in the fall. And that last generation gets some sort of extra boost it will fly all the way back down to South America and it has never seen where South America is but there's a specific location where it will go and it will live until the next winter when it, several generations will come back.